Hi, in this question, we are given that the equation of a line L okay, is given as 6x equals to 14 minus 2y. And in part A, we are asked to write down the gradient of the line L. Okay, so the basic thing or the most important thing we need to do as always is to rewrite it in the form of y equals to mx plus c. So I'm just going to do some basic shifting around. 6x plus 14, and I divide everything by 2, I get minus 3x plus 7. Okay, so this basically means that this is my gradient and this is my y-intercept. Okay, so for part A, the answer m is equals to a negative 3. Okay, that is A, the gradient of the line L. Now, uh, if you were to just try to do a quick sketch of this line, okay, uh, you can see that the y-intercept here is uh, 7, okay, and since the gradient is negative, you can you can say that the line will look something like this, okay, so, so I mean, it's not so straight, but you know, you, you get the idea. So this is the sort of shape of the line, okay, uh, sloping downwards because it is negative gradient, and it's passing through uh, the y-intercept of 7. Okay, now uh, in part B, we are told that there is another uh, line H, okay, which passes through the point 6, 8, and is parallel to the line L. So this is line L, and we have another line H. So the H could be uh, either, I mean, it is the same uh, sort of slope because it is it's parallel, okay. So it's either below this line or uh, above this line, okay. But since we know that it is parallel, okay, so... For part B, okay, we can say that the equation of the line is y equals to uh, negative 3x plus c. And since we know that it passes through this point, we can substitute these points inside. 8 equals to minus 3, 6 plus c. So 8 equals to minus 18 plus c. And c equals to uh, 26. So the equation of the line y equals to uh, minus 3x plus 26. So that is the answer for part B. Okay, the equation of the line H. Okay, and so as you can see, the y-intercept is much higher. So the the line is probably somewhere around here. Okay, so the line H is here. And for part C, we are told that uh, the point N and uh, minus 2N lies on the line L. Calculate the value of N. So for equation uh, L, we know this is the equation L, so y equals to minus 3x plus 7, and the two points given are n and minus 2n. So all I need to do is to substitute these points inside, so minus 2n equals to minus 3n plus 7, minus 2n equals to minus 3n plus 7, n is equals to 7. So that gives you a... Uh, the solutions for this uh, question and it's a fairly easy question and I hope that um, you get an idea of how to uh, solve such a coordinate geometry questions. Thank you.